That's good. Don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. Don't trip. Okay, what am I supposed to do? You're going to come play the piano. Okay. Let's go. Come sit down. Come. I'll Where? help you. Here. Okay. Do you want me to move the chair in a little bit? No, it's not going to move. Okay. Go ahead. I'm recognizing something amazing. Owen would resurrect while sitting at the piano playing music. And Dr. Bronstein said, you are witnessing the power of music changing brain chemistry. Music is a universal language. And it's not spoken by traditional words. And so our community of people, many of whom can't speak anymore, even finish a sentence, can come together and feel the freedom of having music as their language without any hesitation, engage in the moment and feel whole again. Love is a many splendor thing. <laughs> He's got a great sense of humor. <laughs> they feel healthy again. It's really joyful to go there and it really fills me up and I feel that it probably has made a difference in my cognitive skills. And this is based on the principle that the cells in the brain that store music memory are intact. And so patients who are end stage Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, dementia patients, you can still play their familiar melodies even though they are not able to speak anymore and they will light up. We've seen people bedridden and they attempt to get out of bed as they recognize the familiar melodies that they grew up with. And this happens till the 11th hour when they cross over and put their lights out. Well done. It's not an easy piece to put it. <laughs> Thank God for music.